I knew it was a matter of time before Candace Owens would be let go from Daily Wire. I knew that from the time she starts speaking up on behalf of Kanye West. It was obvious that she was a ticking time bomb and that she would be let go. Now, you guys, you, me, everyone knows that Candace Owens is one of the most outspoken people on the planet. This woman stands strong in her convictions, and I think a lot of people can learn from her in how she handles debates. She is very opinionated, but she comes with it, and she knows how to fight fire with fire. She was let go from the Daily Wire, which is owned by Ben Shapiro. He is the owner of that. I actually did a video on this the other day, and I said that, you know, this is two conflict, two conflicting views here. I saw Ben Shapiro do an interview where he was saying that he sees nothing wrong with what Israel is doing, basically. And I'm paraphrasing. I'm not being, you know, don't take me out of context here. He basically was not into her position, which is that this is a genocide and that we need to call for a ceasefire and this isn't fair. You know, uh, too many people are being killed. Candace Owens was speaking up on behalf of the Palestinians, which is a big no-no when you are working for a company run by a man who himself is Jewish. And so I think this is a clear indicator that she's going to turn into like a Tucker Carlson and she's going to go work for herself and we probably will see her on X.